So we'll begin by removing the hind shank right at the joint. Making a radial cut around, trying to keep that cut as consistent as possible without creating any sawing through the muscle as well. We'll move over to this one and separate this as well. It's ideal when butchering to consolidate as much of the same knife work and cut work as possible. Anytime you use a saw, it creates a considerable amount of bone dust, so you want to prevent that by cutting through the muscle first and then following behind with the saw. As soon as you hear that change in sound, you know that you've gone through the bone and you finish that cut with the knife. To finish this cut, same thing. So the easiest way to do that is to separate it up here, right by the knuckle. Then you're going to go in remove some of that membrane and sinew. And then to finish it, we just cut it right here with the saw. Once that's been done, just making sure to remove any excess um, bloody areas and any excess membranes, and then those cuts are ready for going to market.